So what I'd like you to do. All right. What are you guys doing here? We have a project, an Easter yes. project. Yes. All right. You guys are good at coloring. Ooh, look at all those colors. Very good stuff. Um, yes. What's up, Angel? Good morning. Good morning, guys. Good morning. All right. Good morning, Good morning, John. I joined. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. Hey, John got a haircut. John cut his own hair, yes. We're going to rotate and take turns to mix. I'm going to start it now. Watch how I miss. Everybody quiet and listen. I don't hear anything. Thanks for that is the deal. goal. That is the goal, okay? So we want to make sure that this scent is all mixed up with the color and the scent and the wax. That's why we do this type of um, mixing. <laughs> okay? All right, so we're starting with Amar, and we're going to rotate clockwise, so you start stirring. The way that I showed you. Perfect. Now, mine said clockwise. So, if she's, if you're going to go clockwise, the clock, how does it go? To Joshua, or does it go backwards to Christian? It goes to Christian. So that would be not clockwise. Yeah. The clock goes around like this. But, um, the other one is counterclockwise. I hear noise. I wanted a blue because I love blue. But somebody already had it. I would think of blue. I hear noise. That was two times here. Three times. The reason I'm putting spaces is because when we put the wicks, we need spaces. Okay, clockwise, Amar. And I'm also giving you each. Joshua. Oh, no, no, I hear a noise. Yeah. I hear two noises. I'm also giving you each a little tin. Good job, good job. Four. Wow, a mess. Now you're doing it clockwise. Who are you going to give it to? No, we don't give it. We rotate. We rotate. Uh, time out. You went first, right? Then you went. So move around the table. Move around. Amar, move. Amar. No, no. Clockwise. Clockwise. Raise the clock. Keep going. Okay. Keep going. Joshua, move down one. No. You guys are not focusing today. I have focus. Okay, you're moving like the off clock. In here. Do I go now? Yeah. No. Okay, Jason, you missed your spot. You have to go to the front of the of Josh. You will love it. Jason. Stay with, you stay in the same um, order that you were in, but you're rotating. Okay. I'm already in front of Josh. Right here. Excuse me. Stop mixing. Okay. I hear noise. Okay. Next. That's that's a good way to do it, Christian. Without noise. Okay, Christian. Okay, put it down, Christian. And yeah. All right. Same spot, but somehow that got a little mixed up. Yeah. Good job, Dan. I see that you're all imitating. I think he's supposed to stay on the side. Very good. I like the way you're doing that. Okay, next. Jason, finally. Well, watch, I'm not going to even make a noise. Look, Miss Bonnie, look at mine. Oh, very you don't good. hear anything. 
Now, what I would like to tell everybody, and I'm going to tell the next group, is that Jason came to help at our event in March in Coral Springs. And Jason spent about two hours with us. Is everybody listening? You should be saying, wow, congratulations, Jason. You did a great job. You should be supportive of your classmate. Is anybody understanding me? Yes. We did talk about oh, okay. that. I, I promised Jason Our I would announce it. Yes. Right, Jason? Yeah. You did a great job. When are you doing another event? So oh, I don't talk. know. <laughs> That's only once a year in Coral Springs. Only once a year? Yeah. I'll come next year again. Oh, I hope so. That's your second. This, this You did two years with us already. Yeah. All right. <laughs> All right. Okay. Very nice. Very nice. You guys Thank mixed you. incredibly today. Okay. Your first row. Ow. Oh, you stepped on the toilet. Ow, you stepped on the toilet. You're over here. It's okay. Okay. Merry Christmas. You learn no, by watching. Do you see how she's doing it? She's not doing it like this. The way you were doing it. She's doing it. And the reason I'm doing it this way is because I want to make sure that the scent and the color mix all the way from the top to the bottom. So this way, it's kind of called folding when you're cooking, all right? Does anyone think they can do it like this, like I'm doing it? Yeah, uh, me. Said, why don't you come here and do it while I get the heat guard and get everything ready? Right. Uh, look, it don't make noise. You can't sound the TV. It doesn't. I'm good at this, Miss Bellman. Yes, you are. I mean, I am. You are not a scientist. That can be done. I'm going to be teaching somebody else how to do it. Now, Jason, yeah. you're doing a great job mixing, so now, now I, I keep that in my mind. Honey, I'm going to get them all here. What yeah, you know, okay. Yeah. You keep in your mind that what? I keep in my mind that you're a good mixer, so that next time when you come, I say, you know what, Jason is a good mixer. I'm going to have him do a little extra mixing for me. Okay. Okay? Well, mind me next time. Oh, don't worry. I don't forget. Somebody could do the pouring, somebody could do the mixing, somebody could do the decorating. Everybody gets a different job. That's right. I, keep, I remember what everybody does well, and I always call them back the next time to do that job. Right here. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, Jason. That was excellent. Now go back to your spot. Now, one thing that I have to do, and you're going to have to take two step, take one step back over here. All right. Do you remember why I'm doing this? It's green. You're cleaning it? No. What does that sound like? Something that's very hot. A hair blow dryer. Yeah, blow dryer. So what does Miss Bonnie do? Blow drying it? Why? She wants to style the hair? Okay. So no, why? to help it more stick here to make it frozen solid into, uh, into like candles. She does do that. She makes it um, when you were making the candles. She did use that to um, go back to the Good. Don't go But that's not the reason. What does the blow dryer do? If I get out of the shower and I'm blow drying my hair, what is it going to do? It's going to be dry. It's going to dry my hair. No. Bonnie's making sure that there's no water. I'm actually heating them up. You know why I'm heating them up? Hmm. What temperature is the wax? Is it cold or hot? I can't touch it. Right? What temperature? No. What temperature is the wax? What temperature? Yeah. Is uh, it cold? Hot. Very hot. hot. It's hot. It's if hot. you touch it, you can get burned. Right. I don't want to get burned. Now, if I burned. put the hot wax in a cold glass, do you know what could happen? You melt. I can melt. If you put something cold. Hot in something cold. Well, I would detain this. It's on the bottom of the And you spilled in the hot candle, and I put it in a freezer. What could happen? It could. What could happen to the glass? It could break. And I then I definitely don't want to get burned. It so could many The other thing is, from a quality standpoint, 
the warmer the glass is and then the wax, they will end up being the same temperature. So they will mix well together and they won't crack easily. Usually I use some cream to dry with the <laughs> so that's why I use tin a lot of the time. You don't have to warm the tin. But when you're doing glass, you have to warm the glass to make it. Okay, excuse me. Elijah. Here are your glasses. That's where you're supposed to stand. Okay. Jason, you're supposed to stand in front of your glass. Okay. Do I have to put dots on like no. like in kindergarten? No. Okay. I hope not because I think you guys are adults and I don't think we need to put dots to show you where you have to stay, right? Right. When little kids come here to make candles, you know what I do? What? I put colored stickers on their spot and that's how they know to stay in their spot. But I don't think you guys need that because no. you're really more mature. I'm an adult now. That's but right. I am eight yeah. I know. So you want to act like an adult at all yeah. times, right? Okay. So we are going to mix. I mean to pour. Now, one thing about pouring. Do we go like this and just pour it fast? No. no. You be careful. Right. Remember I used to need your help in that last I know. Year? And now you don't. I'm really going to try to keep you guys as independent as possible because that is the goal. Would you tell us when this is done? Yes, of course. Why is it orange? For what sense? Absolutely. And it's also is it for strawberry? That's no. how I want to see it. What sense is it for? Absolutely. Is it coffee? Mm -hmm. You guys forget the scent? Or you, did you forget, guys forget to wake up to the stuff? No. Christian, what scent is it? Come on. I won't stay because I have sandwiches all the Isn't it something with vanilla? Yeah, stop. Well, what color is it? Orange vanilla. Thank you, Jason. I think Jason's the only one that took his uh, wake up room. Good job, Jason. I did. Right, I, I woke up today. Wait, wait. Uh-uh-uh. With yours? Everybody. Yeah. I'm going to make sure. Do we ever grab it without me telling you? No. We can't. Right. Now, what are these for? For them. Um, you know, try to do some decorating where you can. Um, but the little ones, we're going to order a little bit. And we got a little bit. For tomorrow night, we're going to a downtown autism festival. We have to deliver a hunt. Whoa, in Palm Beach. Excuse me. Don't touch the pot. You're touching the pot. The pot could be very hot. Stop. Slow down. You're going way too fast. Slow it down. Very good. All right, you're going to be perfect. Very good. Thank you. Pass it, put it down. Mary, do not touch the pot. Whisper us. You're going you're gonna to cry when you see this. What is Miss Perez? She's in here. Oh. There's Miss Perez. Hi. Hi, good morning. I'm hot. Okay. Miss Lizzo, look at yeah, so far. Oh my God, I love it. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm, you're, I'm getting happier and happier as I see. Finish. Oh, wow, she's an expert oh, colorer. Look at this. Look at that one. That is awesome. Look at this. <laughs> That's a good one too. Great color combination. All right. So you finished? Good morning. So what are these things here? Uh, stamps. 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 What do they have on them? I'm about flowers, flowers and Easter and eggs, and also and then, yeah. a play bug and a butterfly. Mm -hmm. Oh, good stuff. And they come out in a color? Or? Oh, just trying to be small. Like this. Like, is that a green one or is that a blue one? Great job, guys. Okay. Back to your spots. We're ready to do the next side, right? Jason's anxiously awaiting his turn, right? Thank you. 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 Thank you.
reason I tell you stop early, yeah. I know you're thinking you have to do more, but by, when I say stop, by the time you actually stop, it's already filled up to the right level. So what you have to do is you have to listen to me, don't look at anyone around you, listen to me. That's why we work on life tables. Okay? Who else wants to do extra on this side over here? You guys want to do me, extra me, one? Me, 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 I'll come to you. I'll come to you. I'm right there. Mm -hmm. You first. You will come with me. Okay. One thing that I notice that you're doing is you're leaning on here. I don't really want you to lean on here. Try to do it like this. Okay? Because if you lean, sometimes this can just go fling and everything falls all over the place. All right? Chris Press, look out. Darian? No, for you. I have to make cool. And then just put this down when you're done. Good job, David. Right behind you, Josh. Can you give me two more of those little tins? Wait, wait, wait. Josh, I have to Josh, two ten. Two. Tin. 
Yeah, they might have mixed up where they put it. Leave it the way it is. I'm going to go around and I'm going to fix everything. You know what? When you take this stick out, there's enough for it to light. Okay. Is everybody done? So one by one, excuse me, I don't want to get nail elbows. I'm going to come and take your tins away. Can we take them home? No. Not today. These are going to a conference. These are, yeah, these are for customers. They are? Yes. Okay. Miss okay. Bonnie's going to fix it if it, they need to be fixed. We're just following directions. The directions were to stand here and wait patiently for Bonnie to come and take the tip. Yes, I did. Now, a lot of times when you're working, you have to be patient and wait in order to make sure that the quality is good. 
Okay. Patience is a big part of life. Patience is a good job. Thank you. Because if they're not right, then what's going to happen? What's going to happen if they're not good? Oh, my God. Am I going to be able to sell these for three dollars? Maybe. Or if they're not good and we don't have patience, then I'm going to have to put them on clearance. Ready to Next year, next year, one time trip. Hi, the government. I think they did a great job. It's great though. Would you do me a favor? Say hi to Coach Jeb for me. I want to see him. I need to go there. He wants to meet Coach Jeb one day. He's very nice. He'll come when I'm there too. Oh, some. The only way the frosting comes off is if you scrape it off. And some. No, I want to switch groups. We're done. Okay. You guys did okay. All right, we're going to switch. You guys are going to be decorating this. Okay. So you stay here until we are until I call you. We're not ready yet. So what what flavor did you make today? Miss Wendell, how's my buddy Coach Ann? Uh, is nobody listening to me? Are you listening to Bonnie? Yeah. Thank you. What flavor did you make? What scent? Excuse me. Okay. I know you made strawberry. No. So, you made banana? No, no, today. Orange vanilla. Was there sleeping gas on the bus today? You did. I don't even remember. Orange vanilla. Thank you. Orange vanilla. Somebody is paying attention. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. If, if the glass isn't clear, what was the word that Miss Bonnie used? Good job, Amon. It's frosted. Why did Miss Bonnie use the heater? To clean it? No. Nope. To make it... What? Why did she use the heater? Do you remember? Why did she go around using that blower? Oh, she's going to be, how old she? I don't be? know. Christian, do you remember? Yeah. Why? She was born. Why did Miss Bonnie use the blower? Okay, so that it won't wash. If you put in something cold in something. So that it will stick. So that it won't curl. Crack. Crack. Good job. So that it won't crack. Why, okay. Jason, uh, did we use different size wicks? What? So they can fit? You can do that. You so can actually touch the wax once it's pulled off on the Why? table. Why? Yeah. Look at this and look at this. Why do they use different size wicks? Are they all done open here? They are done. Yeah. Okay, you want me to help you bring some No, because I gotta fix it as I bring it. So I don't want to make it. What was magic the three things that you used to make the candles? Everybody should be in their group. A whip, okay. A measuring cup. A measuring cup, what else did you use? They have a basic here, what are these things? What is that called? You used uh, a whisk, a measuring cup. And uh, what is it start with what weather? I'm not going to tell you. What is that silver thing called? We've been going over this from the first day you guys came oh, no. here. A pouring pot. A pouring pot. pot. And what's the other thing that you used? You, you took it from the pouring pot into a... Measuring cup? Into a teapot. Into a teapot. Miss Bonnie, yes. you know, I went to a Chinese restaurant. They told me where to get those corn cups, the, the teapots. I, I found them online, but the ones that they buy are much better than the ones that you could put. Excuse me. She told me, I, I don't know when I'll go back to the restaurant. I totally forgot. Restaurant, supply, warehouse. It's somewhere, I think it's on Riverside. I oh, asked okay. her exactly where she got the Yeah, I'd like cups. to know that if it's on Riverside. If you go to the Inn, the Chinese restaurant. Where is that? It's um, Carl Ridge, um, well, south of Walmart. I guess like five miles. Yeah. Opposite side of Excuse me. A mark. Uh, Angel. Angel. No, Angel already went. Uh, 
Now, one thing I'd really like to have you make more candles with us, but you have to really focus, okay? Because these are much harder to make and to serve, make them perfect than the tins. Because do you know why? Why do you think the tins are easier to do? What, Ms. Summer? I don't think anyone's listening to that. Why are the tins easier to make than the uh, frosted glass? Amal, why do you think that they're easier to make? I didn't make them, so I wouldn't know. What's the reason, Amal? When, give me, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. See this tin? It's small. See this tin? Can you see through here? No. You can't see. That means that if there's a little imperfection, no one's going to see it. But when you make glass, if it's not perfect, it has to go on clearance. Okay? So I'm trusting, trusting you guys to do a great job and make your glass candles for us. Question. If something is on clearance, am I paying more money or less money for it? More? What? Well, you gave me two answers. What? Less money. Why? Is, that a, is, is it perfect or imperfect? If it's on clearance. Unperfect. Right. Is that a good thing for the store to have a lot of clearance? It is. You're guessing? No. Think about it. Is it good for a store to get less money? It's better for them to have more money. Right. So if we have to put a lot of things on clearance, is that good for the store? Not where we're. Not good for the store. So that's why we make sure that everything is perfect. Okay? Okay, excuse me. Let me just get the last bid. Step back. Excuse me. Okay. Okay. So, so, you know, I'm a registered guy. 
angel. I didn't say that you didn't. I'm commenting that Rachel is saving it. And she put it in a special place because she wants to show that. She's very proud of her accomplishment. It doesn't mean that you didn't do it. It just means that she's really excited about it. So, now, first thing you guys need to do a little bit different, okay? is you're going to help me get things ready to pour. Because normally when you come in here, we have everything laid out already, right? Yeah, we just skip the thing in there. Right, but now I need a little bit of help, okay? So one thing that our kids at Sensibility do every day when they come in, they know if I have boxes on the table like this that are open, they know what they have to do. So I'm hoping that you guys can do this too. So I'm going to take, you're going to have two boxes. Okay, what you're going to do is you're going to put the plastic in here. Yeah, don't we do that before? Right? You've done it before. A red thing. You want to be in here or on there? The final competition. And I want, excuse me, it's not a race. I am a It's not a race. Because after you get the plastic off, you're going to put the tops in here and you're going to put the tins in the middle. Very good. You're doing great. Thank you. Good job. I love the way you think it might be Did everybody write your name? Okay. How many are we doing? Both boxes. Yes. 24 in a box. So how much is 24 and 24? 24 and 24. 10 seconds. Sure. Okay, 24 and 24. 28. 28. Very good. 24 plus 20. 28. Plus 24 equals uh, 28. 24 plus 24 equals uh, 24. 28. 24. Plus 24 is? 30. How much for y'all? 30. 30. Uh, you better write the first time. 32. 48. 48. 48. 48. 48. 48. I think you know where I'm going to go. 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 I'm no, no, it's even. And don't scream like that because it bothers my ears. Sounds like having a heart attack. No way. Steve, right? I mean, even Steven. So are we doing all of them or what? There you go. It's even Steven. Even Steven, you're right. Even Steven. Two, four, six, and even things aren't great. Two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, and even things aren't great. I was one of the registers. I was, I was pretending like I was buying a candle. Yeah, me too. Peach mango. Yep. How many are we doing? The whole two boxes. Mm. What a soft mug, man. Ronnie, where do you put the boxes? <clears throat> By the break room on the floor. Sorry.
Miss Vaughn, I just want to I, I just I, I was talking to John today to learn how to do the, the register uh -huh. and I did it. Oh, we awesome. Do. Giovanna did it like I was a customer and she did it for me. Excellent. And I did it for her too. I'm so happy. I got it. Okay, now, you're each going to take, you're each going to, you're each going to take two tins and put them in front of you and put the rest in the middle of the table. Two pens or two tins? Two tins. 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 Oh. Tins. Two tins. These are my two then just put the rest of you're not following the directions. Two tins in front of you like that. Everything else oh, can wait, be in the center. Ryan, two tins in front of you. Ryan, two tins in front of you. We just started though. Say number six. Okay. So what we're gonna do while we're waiting for this is we can do our wicking and get them ready. So take each of you take two of the sixes and put them in the sticks. 
So we're all ready for when after we pour. <laughs> That's called pre preparing our our work so we could save some time. You're putting the wicks in the popsicle sticks, not in the tin, in the popsicle sticks. Don't, don't put them in there. Do you think, what happens if we put them in the, in the tins? There's nothing in there to hold, to, to, to wick, right? I will, like, I will make the, the hole for the, for the little thing, for the wick. All right. Oh, we are going to be making peach mango, and I want to tell you why Sorry. I chose that. Okay. Mother's Day. No. Hey, uh, do you remember we talked about pie sale this morning, right? And we talked about customers coming in. Now, one thing when a customer comes in, they want to see the shelves filled up, right? With the product. If we have a one shelf that only has one thing or it's empty, does that look good for us as a store? No, no that's no. not very business right here. No, because what if someone walked in and said, I really wanted peach mango. I drove all the way here to get peach mango and the shelf is empty. They're not going to come back. Right. So one thing that I have to do is every day we look at the shelves and we know what sold yesterday and what we have to make. Um, we have to make candles for orders, but we also have to make inventory. That's another word. Inventory. Inventory. That's that's that an word. We've talked word. about that before. <laughs> I'm glad I had this privilege. <laughs> we talked about inventory before. Inventory is the products that a store has on the shelf waiting to sell, ready for sale. And guess what? When we, you know how you went into the computer just now? And you ready for sale? How do you think that inventory gets into the computer? Well, do you think I just blink my eyes and it goes in? No. Do you think I talk into a microphone and it goes in? No. How does it go in? It goes through, all through email, all through credit card, all through the machine. That's for money coming in. But when I say, oh, we're going to sell special party candles. If I tell that to the computer, you think it's going to be magically have the I have to do... Right to the it in. In. I have to enter it into the inventory in the system. A computer is only as good as you tell it to be. Yeah. Computer is a very wonderful tool to have, but if you're not running the computer, is the computer going to run itself? No. You have to tell it what you want in there. So what we do is, this is one of my jobs, I make sure that every product that we sell so I make sure that's the color it's going to be. Peach mango. It's a mixture of orange and pink. Because that's Beautiful what a mango color. and a peach is. Right? No, no, it's not. Uh, orange. So one thing that I have to do every day. Um, orange and pink. When we went to the court to. Uh, when we went to Coral Springs Walk and we were selling all those candles, or when we went to your school, remember we were selling at your school? Yes. I had to make sure that those magic candles were in the system so that when someone said, I want to ring it up, we rang it up. Very nice. Okay, now I don't know if you remember, but I was using a tablet at the school. Uh oh. Because we can't bring that whole big computer out front, can we? <laughs> no. That would be ridiculous. You know what? We used to do that, and it was a lot of schlepping for dry. And then what happens if we don't have electricity in our battery? Our battery goes out. Oh no! Mm. Screwed. Screwed, basically. <laughs> I didn't want to say that. So what we do is we can use it on tablets now. So I make sure that all those products are in, so that when you go to ring it up, when it's in here. I know. Okay. I'm gonna do the mixing because we're in a rush. Okay. But you remember the mixing process. How does it have to mix? No, you can't hear anything. You can't hear the right. um, And I'm mixing the scent. Yeah, you can't scratch. Right, I'm mixing the scent with the color and the wax all together, right? Okay. Now, are all your wigs sti in sticks? Make sure they're all in sticks because if you have to leave quickly, then I'm going to be putting the wigs in and I want to make sure they're all ready. Okay? All right. Okay. Can you mix this for a second while I just keep the tape head up? Mm -hmm. Now remember, you're all going to go home with a special gift for someone special, and you could say that you made that yourself, correct? It's working! Okay. It's working. 
Now I'm hoping that when you go back to your class, you can review that documentation that I give Miss Mrs. Feldman and learn all your point of sale terms. Because now you could say, I had experience as a cashier, right? Did you enjoy doing the computer? Yes. Yeah. Cool, right? You yeah. know who wrote that software? John did. John designs everything. He wrote that just for you guys so that it would make up all Steve's job. How did he learn that? All of these things. I don't know. Next time I know he has uh, uh, his own business with computers. We actually do. That's what John does. John doesn't work in the candle business really. He just helps me. He has a software company and he helps people that work in gyms and health clubs. That's wow. what our software does. Oh my goodness. I gotta hire him for me. So he can train me how to do that. He checks people in, he brings up sales, he does the billing, but and he has over five hundred clubs across the world wow. using that software. Wow. Even people in India, wow, in Kuwait. Wow, wow. We have lots of clubs in Kuwait or all the princes. Look no. Kuwait. Kuwait is a country in the Middle East. Oh, we yeah. have in the Bahamas, in Puerto Rico, oh, really? on the islands, all over the United Spanish. States, in Hawaii. There's what? People all over using that software. Okay. Oh, beautiful. That is, that is tea, like tea. Yeah, I'm me. going to. I, I, can drink that. I know you guys are real independent, so we're going to go. I wish I can drink that mint for you. It's really good. Do not delicious. touch the tin down. No, put your tin down. Put your tin down. You're going to burn your finger. Stop, 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 stop. When I say to stop, you put it down. You've got to listen because, number one, it was on something. Let me fix that mark. If I say stop and you don't listen now, I, this is what I told the other kids. Even though I say stop, sometimes you think you still need to pour more. But by the time that you stop, it will be perfect. Okay, so let's try doing this one, and I want you to stop the second I tell you, okay? Okay. That's like a plan. They had everybody for jam. I missed them. Stop. Perfect. Much better. Okay? Now, because you're my advanced group, I want you to take your squares and put them in. I'll go fix them after that. You are my best listeners. Right? Okay. Okay. Can you help for it? Okay. Can you mix well? Yeah. Just do again. Come on, and then we're going to do some more. Put your hand in. Mm. Mm. Even with my kids, I always fix the tops. 
Anyway, I'm going to tell you about the studio. 